Hi, I'm making a video today of all grain brewing to try and help someone who may be starting out on all grain brewing for the first time. It may not be correct but it has worked for me over a period of a few years. Enjoy. Firstly I will run through the equipment I'll be using. This is a 50 litre cool box which has been converted into a mash tun. Inside the mash tun you can see a strainer which is connected to a stainless steel tap on the outside that strains the mashed liquor into a bin. And here you can see the stainless steel tap on the exterior of the mash tun. Here we have a 50 litre pan which is used to bring the mash up to the required temperature and is also used for the boil. At the completion of the boil the liquor will be put in the fermenting bin and cooled down with the copper pipe. This bin is just used to give me a guide of how many litres I am using. Today I'll be making a clone of Boddington's Bitter. Here we have the ingredients weighed out and the appropriate water treatment. Okay, I have the mash liquid now at 70 degrees, higher than what we need, but obviously as the malt is added the temperature will drop. We are now ready to start our 90 minute mash. So 90 minutes are up now and we are ready to sparge. So we are now ready to sparge and I will drain the first jug of liquor and this will be returned carefully to the mash. So using water slightly hotter than the mash temperature, around 70 degrees, slowly jug water over the mash. Ok, I've collected 10 litres of liquor now and I shall commence the boil with the 10 litres of liquor and then keep on sparging. A good way to tell when sparging is finished is to have a sample of the liquor coming out of the tube. And if there's no hint of sweetness and just tastes like water, your sparging is complete. I've got these two barbecue skewers and I have measured in my boil pan. Uh, on the left hand side is the 25 litres and on the right hand side up to 23 litres so I know exactly or about how much is in my boil pan at start and at the finish okay we are now at boiling point so I'm going to put in the first batch of hops Double check with a stick. And we have 25 litres of liquor in there. So, so while the boil is going on, 
um, it's time to sterilise because everything that com comes in contact with the liquor after it's left the boil pan needs to be sterilised. In the uh, fermenting bin, I've got um, I've put the chiller in, even though I don't think it's necessary, as it goes into the boil for the last ten minutes. Um, plastic spoon, jug, and a sieve. Okay, we are almost one hour into the boil, and if you look back at the recipe at the start, you realise there was some sugar involved that has been dissolving in some liquor it's brought to the boil and I shall now add that to the boil okay we have 10 minutes left now on uh, boil time and it's time to add the second lot of hops and the Irish moss At this stage as well, I'm also going to add the uh, chiller to the boil. Okay, the boil is now complete. I will now strain the liquor into the fermenting bin. Okay, we are now ready to turn the chiller on. As you can see the uh, fermenting bin is well covered while it's chilly to stop anything getting in that shouldn't. So sterilising now I've put uh, I have got two hydrometers that tend to give different readings funnily enough so I'll take a, an average between the two. Uh, I've got the base of a hand blender which I use to aerate the beer um, I've been doing grain brewing for about three years and I've found this is the best way to aerate your beer. And then in the jug I have the thermometer sterilising so I can make sure I've got the optimum temperature to pitch the yeast. Okay we are 21 minutes into chilli and our temperature is down to 20 degrees. So I'm happy with that and it's time to take out the chiller. So here we are, 25 minutes after boil time and we are ready to aerate and then pitch yeast. complete. So the uh, final action now is to uh, put the yeast in. And 
that's it for a few days okay we have 24 hours now since the yeast was pitched and everything seems to be going okay <laughs>